Welcome back guys for another video beer review and we've got a Green King beer to take a look at today it's a Suffolk Strong Dark Ale it's coming in at 6% ABV in a 330ml bottle um, quid a bottle for my local off license I have seen it before um, it normally comes out around Christmas time they do it like in a, a presentation box with a with a glass you get like four beers so like 10 quid something like that um, from all, all the big supermarkets weren't prepared to purchase that but doing singles in the local off here I thought I'll give it a go um, I think Harry Meadows has reviewed this beer or one of them I haven't actually seen it yet but bit of smoke Okay, beer in the glass. Yeah, really dark mahogany. There's a bit of light bleeding through the bottom. Half a finger of off-white head, almost, almost mocha. Slow levels of carbonation. Yeah, apparently, um, as the name suggests, strong Suffolk, not for the faint-hearted. We blend. A proportion of our very special and rare vintage 5x brew with a rich malty dark ale to create a deep satisfying complex beer just one of our selection of great tasting beers created by Green King at our home in Bury St Edmunds yeah malty dark fruits almost uh, a port wine smell to it cheers It's got a nice, rich, slightly boozy fruitcake sort of feel to it. But the mouthfeel. It's too thin. It's just a watery mouthfeel to it. Which I find with a lot of their beers, they they have got a nice bit of flavour in there, but it's just I don't, maybe it's just me. I don't know, but it's just a, a thin, watery mouthfeel on the back end. But th there is some positives to take from it. It has it has got a rich taste to begin with. I'm getting a bit of warmth. It's just to finish it thin. Yeah, it's like sort of like raisins, maybe plums, figs, that sort of thing. sweet maltiness to it but it quickly fades away it's almost washed out by this watery finish to it you know around that sort of thing I'm, I'm waffling now would I buy it again? nope I'm curious to try the others, just just from a review perspective. Um, it's just beers I haven't tried. I want to try them. But yeah, a, a, another Green King.
beer ticked off the list. Um, it's alright, it's nothing amazing. Suffolk Strong Dark Ale. There you go, I don't know what sort of series this is. One off series, I, I don't know. don't know, I need to look online about it. But there you go, guys, anyway. Leave a comment down below, tell me if you've had this beer, what you think about it, and all that. And I'll see you on my next one. Cheers.